Hey, Shalom, I'm mocking your brother, because I'm back at you with the shoe. Start by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Howl by Shimmy Al-Shai by Shimmer Kakadash. Double honors and respect go to the apostles and elders of great most of who well teach well leader Israel by great example to this day. Peace and salutation go to elect, teaching and preaching his truth, and the righteousness, and this righteousness, purity, sincerity, and waiting on your house, Shalom, Lord, and we call Jesus Christ for salvation. Shalom, I'm mocking. All right, I'm going to make this a quick lesson. All right, quick hit. Okay. Uh, you just we just have to grip with the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashim El Shai, all right, and just be prepared, you know, at all times, all right. You know, as the scripture would say, uh, give me a moment, Ephesians. Ephesians. Uh, Ephesians one, okay. Ephesians chapter five verse one. Be ye therefore followers of Yahweh as as their children, as their sons. All right, and walk in love as Hamashiach also have loved us, have given himself for us, and he given himself for the elect of the nation of, of the nation of Israel. Okay, no uh, no other nation the Lord is going to give himself for. All right, the Lord is only dealing with one nation as the nation of Israel, and beginning with the elect. The elect is a nation. All right, is a nation outside the nation of Israel, okay? All right, giving himself for us an offering and a sacrifice to Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai for a sweet smelling, smelling Savior, okay? Us going on, us showing our faith, all right, on a on a uh, on a, um, cheap place of concourse, okay, in the street corners, all right. That's this that's that sweet uh, Savior that we're sending up to Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai. Okay, us doing these lessons, these sit downs to edify the flock. All right, building each other's uh, spirits up. Okay, all right, following uh, beautifully getting in order and following the way Yahweh Shimei Shai want us to uh, want his um, doctrine to be set up. Okay, um, let's jump down. Uh, Let's keep on reading. But fornication, all uncleanness, or covetousness, let it not be once named among you as become as saints. Okay, neither filthiness nor foolish talking nor jesting, which are not convenient, but rather giving up thanks. All right, thanks for what? This truth. All right. Unlike this world, they think the truth is Jesus Christ is gonna. So the the fake Jesus Christ is coming back to save everybody. No. All right, uh, Yahweh Shai is only coming back to save the elect. Okay, and the true name, all right, the true name in the world called Jesus Christ of the Lord and Savior is Yahweh Shai, and he's only here for the nation of Israel, the elect, beginning with the elect. Okay, so the the filthy talking is basically bringing up Jesus Christ and all right false doctrines of, of Esau. With the, and the heathen, all right, all right, uh, 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 putting your hand in many different shares of plows that doesn't make any sense. When there's only is one, when there's only one truth. Okay. Verse five. For this ye know that no whoremonger, nor unclean person, nor covet, nor covetous man who is an idolater have any inheritance in the kingdom of Mashiach. And of Yahweh, all right. So no, no non-believers, no, no man, all right, giving, uh, giving themselves into the flesh and the worldly things, all right. Of this, uh, of this affair of this life, the affair of this life is going to make it to the kingdom, all right. Meaning it, his doctrine is not tight, is not pure, and it's, yeah, it, it's as vomit. Okay, let's jump down to verse five. See then that ye. Ephesians chapter 5, verse 14. Let's start at 14. 13. But all things that are reproved are made manifest by the light, by the knowledge of Yahweh Bashim Yashai. For whatsoever do make manifest is light. Wherefore he saith, Awake thou that sleepest, and arise from the dead. And the Mashiach shall give thee light. Give us this knowledge. Give us this uh, the baptism of, of fire, of going through the... Uh, going through the Temptations, all right. So this is what this is what's building us. 
and making us grow uh, in purity. Okay. Verse 15, see then that ye walk circumspectly, not as fools, but as wise. All right. Because before this, we was unwise of having different philosophies from many, many different avenues. All right. But the Lord, all right, saw grace in us. All right. He saw grace and he made us turn back to the right wing. All right. Through, through the, uh, yeah, through the head apostles and elders. All right. Prophets, messengers. All right. We got the word of Yahweh Shemiah Shai. And Yahweh Shemiah Shai made us hearken unto the word. Okay. And verse 16, it says, redeeming the time. What time? All right. This time around. Redeeming the time because the days are evil. Why? Because all right, man has become wicked. All right. Man has uh, given unto uh, the flesh, which then they're about to read corruption. Okay. Let's read um, Acts 1. I'm going to read book of Acts chapter 1. Start at verse 6. It says, When they therefore come together, they ask of him, saying, Lord, will thou at this time restore again the kingdom of Yahweh? Matter of fact, start at verse 5. Okay. Uh, it says, For John truly baptized with water, which is the knowledge of Yahweh. And, and, and the son, Yahweh Shai, but ye shall be baptized with the Holy Spirit not many days hence. Okay? And we in those times where the Lord is about to uh, uh, give us the, the true uh, Rokakadash, all right, which is the spiritual power. But right now we are baptized with the understanding of these scriptures. That's the Holy Spirit. All right? When, the, when they therefore were come together, they asked of him, saying, Lord, will thou at this time restore it again the kingdom of kingdom to Israel because at that time the apostles the disciples got this like a uh, small spiritual power from Yahweh from Yahweh okay so they was amazed and it was astonished and they thought that Yahweh will have the kingdom established at that time but it was it wasn't time yet all right because a lot wasn't done all right see that's the power of Yahweh all right he brings excitement to you all right in your in your spirit Okay, excitement is just basically, all right, an increase of energy, all right, to to uh, and that turns into spiritual power, all right, through Yahweh Hashem El Shai. Okay, it says, um, verse seven, and he said unto them, it is not for you to know the times or the seasons, all right, and we are in those times and the seasons, which the Father have put in His own power, so the the, the uh. The Father, the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, know the times and the season when, when uh, He's gonna uh, establish the kingdom of heaven. And we in those times where the Lord is about to uh, make this devil come down with great wrath, and Jacob's trouble happen, and then Micah, to, I mean D Daniel, all right, twelve and one is gonna come to a full blown effect. Okay, it's gonna be like a time like no other. You go, we, we, we gonna, it's gonna be action packed. Angels against uh, uh, demons, all right? Basically, the demons is uh, Esau and his, his army, okay? So, it's going gonna, it's, it's gonna to be an action-packed time. Um, it says, but ye shall receive power, all right? But ye shall receive power. Who? The elect of the nation of Israel. After that, the Holy Spirit, which is the Rakakadash, has come down, come upon you. And ye shall be witnesses unto me, both in Jerusalem and all Judea, all right, and in Samaria, and unto unto the uttermost part of the earth. So we are going to be witnesses of Yahweh Shai, that His power is true, right? and then people, uh, our people is going to see that power, and, they, and then they're going to want to believe. All right, some is going to be too late, some is going to mock, and some is going to uh, be since uh, some some the Lord is going to have mercy upon. So we are waiting for that for that for that time to happen, and it's very near than we think. Okay, and um, let's get a closing precept. Get a closing precept.
John 17, verse 9, I pray for them, I pray not for the world, but for them that which thou hast given me, for they are thine. All, verse 10, and all are mine, all are mine are thine, and all thine are mine, and I am glorified in them. And who is that, who the Lord is glorified? In the elect. All right, so the Lord pray for us, not for this world, and not for two-thirds of our people. All right, so... Yahweh Shem Yashai is about to uh, um, step up the game, all right, and have us show miraculous works through his power, all right, all right, because the Lord had enough with this world, all right, and he's getting ready to uh, uh, show miracles of feeding us, all right, giving us spiritual power, the protection of the angels, all right, and then he's going to give us a mouth. All right, that the adversary can't gainsay, gainsay against. So be prepared for all these things, Akim. All right? And, um, and I can read verse 11. And, and now I am no more in the world, but these are in the world. Who's, who's the these? The, the elect. And I come to thee, Holy Father, keep through thy own name, which is Yahweh, why Yahweh Shai, those, thou, those whom thou hast given me, that they may be one, as we are, all right. So we in Yahweh shine, Yahweh shine in us, all right. So Lord willing, this lesson was edifying and exhorting because the Lord's getting ready to show, all right, the true power of faith. All right, I want to end up by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rokakadash. Double honors and respect go to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who well and teach for and lead Israel by great example to this day. Peace and salutation go to the like. Teaching and preaching is truth, and it's righteousness, spirit, and sincerity, and waiting on Yahweh Shai, whom the world and even called Jesus Christ for salvation. Shalom, Makim. Stay strong in the spirit. We almost out here with the salvation of Yahweh Shai. Shalom.